What's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix a black screen or some kind of issue of that in Red Dead Redemption 2. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll probably know what to do in order to fix this issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right onto my YouTube channel. It will really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be a big support for me guys. I mean, it's free for you and you would support my work here on YouTube a little bit I would really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that and I would just say let's get right started So the first step in order to fix the black screen issue in uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 is gonna be to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen clicking onto the Windows symbol and using the Windows search function uh, to type in Windows Defender firewall. So once this pops up, you should be able to left click it and Afterwards this tab will open up So what I want you to do is gonna be to navigate to the top left corner of your screen clicking onto allow an app or feature for Windows Defender firewall You're gonna click that and once this tab pops up I want you to left click change settings you should be able to do that uh, by being an administrator so left click This will take quite a few moments to so wait and once you left clicked it, uh, you should be able to click allow another app. So once you clicked allow another app, you should be able to add an app by clicking onto browse and search for Red Dead Redemption 2. I can't really tell you now to uh, click on this or that folder because everyone just uh, located it somewhere different. So just you need to search for Red Dead Redemption 2. And once you found it, you should be able to click on add. And afterwards, you should be able to have no issues anymore with black screen in Red Dead Redemption 2. Yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. Guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one, and bye.